Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle for Tuesday the 5th of April 2022. Hope you are keeping well. It's Tuesday evening here. I just finished watching yesterday's uh, University Challenge um, uh, British TV program which this year has been really wonderful. Last year was very good too. Last year there, were, there was an American guy I think. I think I remember a guy from New York who was really outstanding and this year there have been several players who were really really good for in fact uh, in the two in each team uh, I would say um, that uh, arrived in the final and the two best teams made it to the final and I think ultimately the best team won um, but they are both they were both great teams um, and if you don't know <laughs> if you check it out you can check it out on YouTube uh, if you're not in the UK, um, I think it's uh, it's kind of posted to people outside the UK uh, because it probably breaks copyright or something. But you can you can find it on YouTube if you're not based in the UK and check out a guy named Zhang <laughs> and go through the whole series. This guy <laughs> was amazing. If if you think that Google knows every place on Earth, I tell you that Zhang or however you pronounce his name, I think he's from Singapore, actually knows more places than Google. This guy is the geography expert <laughs> you've never seen anything like it really amazing in throughout the whole series a brilliant um scholar of geography right okay let's get on with the sudoku game should we that's why you're here i suppose aren't you it's time for the um los angeles times expert level game can i see anything i'm looking at the i wasn't even looking i was chatting to you not even looking i've seen something there we go Right, here's an 8 nicely blocking up this column and an 8 blocking across here. So let's put an 8 into that square there, shall we? Um, I can see 3's blocking up here, 3's blocking down here, and 3 blocking across there. So I shall niftily put in a 3 there. I see twos blocking across here and across here and down here. So let's have a two there, shall we? Uh, I'm not looking at the twos, but I will confuse you if I keep them highlighted. So, because you might think I'm about to suggest something when I'm really not. Okay, here we go. There's a 7 blocking across here like this, so that's a 7. Now there's a 4 blocking up there, so that's a 4 and a 5 will finish that off. 5 blocking down here and 5 blocking down here, 5 across there. So that's a 5 to go there. We have four blocking down here, four across there, so we can place a four there as well.
we have nine blocking down here that puts nine in one of these two squares uh, so nine blocking across this row nine across this row and nine down here so now we can place a nine just there Right, time to concentrate. Um, <laughs> losing my concentration again. Right, where are we? Um, Let me just uh, bang on the numbers for just a short period of time in case I get any ideas. Ideas above my station. Oh, okay, I've spotted something. Three and eight block along here. So three and eight are in this, these two squares. Uh, so knowing that's three and eight, uh, we have two and six blocking this square. So the last number that we need for this block here is a, has got to be a seven, right? And two and six will be along here now. Uh, that's good because 2 and 6 also block down here so 2 and 6 blocking across here we actually know 2 and 6 are in these two squares here and now we have 7 blocking down here 7 blocking down here so we know that that is a 7 that's going to put a 7 there um, right missing numbers up from this column are what uh, 8 and nine I think so the nine blocks this square here so nine goes there and eight is the last number there this then will become a one this number down here is a nine and uh, we also what were these I've forgotten again see this is why <laughs> whatever was in here six and two wasn't it so these are six and two so that's got to be a one okay right Okay, a little flurry there of activity. Okay, so since we have one blocking across here and one blocking down here, we can place a one in one of these two squares blocking down, one blocking across here and one blocking there. So that's got to be a one just there. Uh, I do believe we are lacking 2567. Am I right? Have a quick look for me, dear viewer. Is this right? 256 and 7? I think so. So we got 2, 6, and 5 here. So this has got to be a 7 then. That's the only one left to get there. So then 7 across here, 7 across there. We'll place a 7 there. 7 blocking up here, up this column, across here, and across here. We'll put 7 into that square there. And we'll go seven blocking down here, down here, across 
these two rows for the final seven. Okay. Um, okay, clearly uh, this can't be five. Okay, so fives are up here. So this has got to be two six. Now this, I said this was two six, right? And this is two six. So these two squares are two six. So what's left must go here and here. And what's left is three and eight. And that doesn't give me the answer <laughs> I was hoping for. <laughs> oh well, never mind. Oh yeah, I said this was three and eight, didn't I as well? Ah, okay. Oh no, not okay. <laughs> not okay, not okay. Here's something easy that I've overlooked. Four blocking up here and up here and four across here. Puts the four into this square. Four across here, four up here and four across the top. Places a four there, four down here, four down here and four across there. So that's a four. Okay. What are the missing numbers here? One and four. Five. So the missing numbers here are eight and nine. Okay, so we got nine blocking across here. So that must be our nine. That must be our eight. And now eight blocking down here and down here. So that's an eight. The one blocks down here, in fact. So that is a one and that is our five. Um, five blocking up here and across here. So this is a five. Um, missing numbers at the top here are three and uh, six. Actually, six blocks down here, so I can get the six here as well. So six blocking across there puts a six in here and a two there. This eight means this can't be an eight, so eight is down here. Now this is a three. If you remember, I said three and eight there before. Uh, one number missing here it looks to be a two. Uh, what else? One number missing down here. The number we still require is a three, I think. And up here, the last number is a five. There we go. One number missing here is a one indeed. Uh, we have one blocking up here, or one up here. One across these rows, so put, so putting a one up there. Missing numbers here are three and eight. We have a blocking eight here, so eight goes there, three goes here. This seems to have been a very easy game, doesn't it? I um, hope I haven't accidentally clicked on the easy level game again, as I have done more than, well, at least once in the past. Threes are in this square. Uh, last number here is uh, six. Six blocking up here and across here, so that's a six. One number left for this row, which is a nine. Um, how are we 
we doing now? Uh, what's missing across here? Two. One. Okay, this is okay. We've got two and five blocking this square, so two and five are here. So this is uh, nine. Or you could just walk through and say there's one number missing in this column and say that's a nine. Whichever way you want to do it, really, it's up to you. This two blocks this square, so two has to be here and five has to be here like this then of course this will be a five and uh, the two blocking up here now puts a two in that square the missing number here is an eight I've definitely got to go and check this but wasn't the uh, accident I accidentally clicked on the easy level two blocks here so that's a two because this has been far short of a an expert level game today so anyway uh, if it's if it appears on the channel under the uh, name of expert, you know that it was the expert level game. If not, <laughs> I played the wrong game by accident. Okay, that's it. Uh, thank you. And don't forget to check out University Challenge on YouTube if you enjoy that kind of thing. Bye-bye.